it's Jessie here. I'm back with another video. It's been a little while since I sat down and did a face-to-face -face video that didn't um, involve a weigh-in. So today I thought I would just do a super simple, super quick what's in my bag video. It's been a long time since I did one um, and I've got some things in my bag here that are maybe not typical so I thought it'd be fun to share. The bag that I am carrying today is my Tano Boogie Bucket. I've had this for probably five years now. I don't know if the Boogie Buckets from Tano are still available. If they are, I will link it down below. I know for certain you won't be able to get this exact color. This is in um, the color Atlantis, and it was um, one of the colors, like I said, like five springs ago. So um, I know that Tano, for a while there, was releasing the Boogie Bucket in different colors every season. I don't, it's been a long time since I looked on their website, but if they have them, I will link them. So I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into what is in my bag because I'm getting ready to walk out the door in the next 15 minutes or so, so I need to share this with you and then be on my way. So the bag is a really nice kind of over-the-shoulder bag, it does not have a big long strap, it has a um, button closure there, which I'm not certain you can see to keep it closed. It's a really nice bag. It's leather. Um, mine is kind of beat up and faded because I've had it for so long, but I love it. Um, I love the aesthetic of it. I just think it's so pretty. And the lining inside, as you may have seen, is this pretty purple color. So the first thing in my bag are a pair of sunglasses. These are just Star Kid sunglasses. You guys, if you've been watching my videos for a while, you know my obsession with the um, musical theater group Star Kid. They do musical parodies. Um, you can check them out on YouTube if you want. I'll link them down below as well. But uh, these are just their kind of brand sunglasses. Or, or the, you know, their, um, these are just like their merchandise sunglasses. So I like the bright fun green. I think it's fun. I like to wear obnoxious colors. Um, next up, what's taking up the majority of my purse here is my Erin Condren Life Planner. Um, if you guys watch my videos, you've probably seen my Plan With Me videos. I'm a huge planner girl. Up until recently, I was all about my Happy Planner, but I've recently switched into this, and I'm loving it. may still go back to the Happy Planner at some point. In fact, I'll probably end up using both, but um, for now, I'm all about my Erin Condren Life Planner. And um, in the little folder here, I have my... Um, Weight Watchers books. I like to keep these on hand, um, especially today. I'm going to a Weight Watchers meeting, so I need this little red book here to weigh in. Um, but I like to keep them in my planner at all times so that I have them at a moment's notice. This green one here is a pocket guide. It has just like a quick um, points value for certain foods um, that you need might need on the go. So I like to have those. And uh, they, I just put those into my little keep it together folder in the back. And that way I can just carry this with me. This thing is like my lifeline. I don't know what I would do without this. I put all of my um, to-do lists and my daily appointments and everything in here so it really helps keep me on track. I like to carry that with me. Um, I'm still in the main pocket. I don't really have too much in the side pockets to speak of. Um, I have a snack in here which I don't know is maybe unusual but like I said I'm getting ready to go to my Weight Watchers meeting. Um, and I weigh in at my Weight Watchers meeting. If you guys haven't seen my uh, Weight Watchers videos, um, I'll link my what I ate in a day, like day in the life on Weight Watchers videos. Um, I'll link the playlist down below so you guys can check that out. But um, I do not eat breakfast first thing in the morning on weigh-in days. I just take a little snack with me to my meeting. So that's what this is. I've got some red grapes and some Melba toast here. Um, I also have a cheese stick, just, you know, randomly tossed into my bag, why not? Um, I have a receipt to Walmart, just randomly thrown on the bottom there. I did not clean out my purse before I decided to make this video, maybe I should have. I have my wallet. This wallet was a gift from my um, stepmother-in-law for Christmas, and um, I love it. I don't know where it's from, but I really, really like the like the kind of tribal print on it. Um, in here I just have some receipts, my cards, a um, little bit of cash, like $8 or something. I don't carry cash typically. And, you know, the usual insurance cards and whatnot for my kids. So there's that. Um, the only other thing in this main pocket here, oh, a couple more things. I have a Neutrogena Moisture Smooth Color Stick. This is in the shade... Pink grapefruit. I really like this. I think I got this in a Target beauty box. 
and I have my car keys. The only real key rings I have on here are my um, Planet Fitness membership card and this little keychain that my son made me. And then of course I have my car key, house key, you know, mailbox key, PO box key, you know, keys. <laughs> Um, so that's it for the main pocket. I have one little zipper pocket here along the side, and I just have random stuff jammed in there. I have a NYC Smooth Skin Pressed Face Powder. I have a Papermate Inkjoy Gel Pen in pink. I really like the Inkjoy Gel Pens. If you're a pen girl like I am, check out the Inkjoy Gels. Mine are in the 0.5 millimeter size. I know they also have a 0.7, so keep that in mind. Um, I have a grocery list. This, um, I believe, came from the Dollar Tree, this little notepad. It's really cute with this little uh, food on the top. Either Dollar Tree or Target. And the last thing in that little slide pocket is my combination lock. I keep this in my bag. That way I have it if I need to go to the gym. I just lock my purse in the locker at the gym and I, you know, hop on the treadmill. So. There's that. I have one in my gym bag as well. <laughs> um, and the only other thing that I have in my purse is, it's got a little slide pocket there, and I have my phone. My phone is a really old um, Samsung Galaxy S3, so I don't buy the latest and greatest in phones because, quite frankly, I can't afford it. So that's it. That's what is in my bag. I don't know. Um, just kind of felt like sharing that with you this morning and hopefully you guys enjoyed this <clears throat> give it a thumbs up if you did don't forget to check out all those videos that I mentioned um, subscribe if you haven't done so already I'd love to have you back and I'll talk to you again soon bye everyone <laughs>